I live in a community that has rules. I follow those rules. Anyone who moves in here has to sign a paper. They're given the rules and the paper says that we agree to follow those rules. It's very possible that I'm the only person in this entire 1,000 plus person community that's following the rules. Okay, I'm special. Anyway, uh, we have a bulletin every month and there are phone numbers in there. My uh, messages on somebody's phone here, somebody who, who, who's involved with activities are not returned. My emails are not returned by another person because I wanted to put some kind of notice in the bulletin if anyone's interested for ladies having an informal soccer team, you know, six feet apart, masks on. My emails don't get, get answered. So after being annoyed a while, I'm thinking, well, I'm not going to let them stop me from doing good things. And if nobody wants to do those good things with me, then I'll do them myself. So I have a new routine. After I go shopping, you know, either once a week or once every two weeks, I have a soccer ball in the car, in the truck. And after all my errands are, are done, before I go back to my house, I stop in the front and I park right next to the basketball hoop. And I get out and I shoot basketball with my, with my soccer ball. Anyway, the first time, it took me three minutes to get one basket. But the other day this week, it took me only two minutes, so I'm getting better. It has to be good for me. It feels really good to be out in the fresh air. There's a big field next by, next next door to it. Um, there's some rocks with water flowing, a little lagoon, so it's nice. And maybe somebody driving by will will see me and and be inspired to do some outdoor exercising. You know, if people don't want to help you or join you or even acknowledge you, then, you know, you're better off. At least you know now who's who. So in the future, you'll be very wary of anything they say or do or any promises they make. Now, so the next thing I'm planning to do is uh, when I take the dog up front where that field is, because there's a lot more room to walk and it's more pleasant than being around some of my neighbors around here near my house. Anyway, when I do that, I'm planning to start jogging with the dog. So I think about the old saying, success is the best revenge. And it is. Don't give these people negative people the satisfaction of knowing that they bugged you or they annoyed you or they're you know preventing you from doing good things do it yourself anyway if you're a religious person there's always guardian angels around it's a good thing we can't see them it would be very distracting think about it 